Hello, good morning, good afternoon. I today would briefly like to introduce this medicine, uh, Jiao Wei Xiao Yao San. And this is a, one of the most famous and widespread formulas in Chinese medicine and Japanese medicine, Korean Oriental medicine. And it's maybe in most cases the most useful thing in depression it's difficult to generalize about certain Chinese herbal formulas are extremely versatile so it's difficult to generalize about what they're for but for example I have a lot of experience using this for depression um, it's also uh, often used for premenstrual, uh, any kind of menstrual problem, uh, more or less any kind of menstrual problem, especially before the period, premenstrual tension, breast distension, acne before period and so forth, because these things are considered to be ca caused by heat in Chinese medicine theory. And generally speaking, this formula is a heat reducing formula. So the basic formula is called Xiao Yao San. Xiao Yao is a phrase from an ancient Chinese book which means happy wandering. Uh, uh, it's from a story, I don't remember the story, but it's just a sort of happy carefree person wandering around the world enjoying themselves. So that gives you an idea of the psychological indications. Jiao uh, Wei means added uh, herbs. The two added herbs are um, uh, jiuzi, it's a gardenia bulb, gardenia flower bulb, uh, jiao wei, jiuzi dampi, mu dampi is a peony flower, root uh, or stem I think, both of them clear heat from the body which has a calming effect uh, psychologically. Um, the main ingredients, however, are chai hu, uh, chai hu bai shao. Bai shao is again a peony, peony, I think peony. Maybe I was wrong about mu dan pi. I think maybe bai shao is a peony flower, is it? Uh, anyway. The Latin names is not 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 really the main thing here. So chai hao, uh, bai shao, chai hu is a kind of a twig, and it's really important in lifting up depression, and um, also for people who have prolapse, it, it lifts lifts up prolapsed organs to a certain extent. Uh, bo he, bo he is mint, mint is in here, um, helps in the cooling effect and the lifting effect. Uh, Baiju. So, the thing is, this is not a, this is not like a ginseng. There's no ginseng in here, and there's no astragalus, which is a very invigorating medicine. So there's there's baiju, which is a kind of w much weaker than ginseng, but it specialises in removing excess fluid from the body. So baiju and fuling is a kind of fungus. It comes in cubes like a mushroom. These two things together help to invigorate <coughs> invigorate the digestive system. And um, uh, remove excess fluid from the body. It can be fluid retention, can be useful for women, uh, but also men. Uh, Jigan Sao is uh, licorice, honey fried licorice. Uh, it's partly to take away the bitter taste of the some of the bitter herbs in here. Wei Jiang, uh, it's ginger, it's a kind of ginger. Uh, that's it. Dung Wei is popularly known, I think, in, s sold in health food shops as Dung Kwai. Uh, Dung Kwai. I think Dung Kwai may be the Japanese name or maybe the Cantonese name. So. All in all, uh, one of the most useful uh, formulas in Chinese medicine. 
and I hope I've given tried to give a general overview with a ex brief explanation of ingredients um, in case you, you, you're seeing a practitioner maybe they're not always able or willing to explain fully so maybe this will help a bit have a lovely day <laughs>